I'm indecisive. Waiting till the end of the day ensures that I have no brain space left for making decisions. Hi, Allie. Just wanted to catch up on a project that I'm doing, which I'm very excited about. I am making myself a new corset for the new me. What's that? Is that you? After having born two children, I found that my body has changed in shape. The corset that I'd made before I had my babies, it still fits. It's not like it's bad. It's just, it doesn't have the right proportion anymore. Clothes are made for your body. Your body is not made for your clothes. I'm making a new corset um, using a red threaded pattern, the 1860s gourd corset pattern. And I'm very excited for this more curvy pattern to fit my more curvy shape. Oh, she's making sleepy face. She's like. And after all the changes my body's went through, it deserves a beautiful corset that makes her look. And that is exactly what this is going to be. I'm so pumped. Oh, are you pumped? Why? I thought you were gonna. No, no, don't wake up. Go to sleep. I did the mock-up and I think it looks super good and I was shocked to find that I didn't really need to do a lot of adjustments on it at all. I think it's gonna be fine. I might have to take in the bust gussets a little bit, but otherwise I think it'll be good. The mock-up, I just pulled the, the busk out and then the laces off the back and then I sewed those pieces onto here so I could try it on. And it looked really good, it fit really well. This is what I've got so far. So this is kind of what it looks like so far. Yeah, it's, I still think it might be a little bit big in the bust, but now that I'm thinking about it, I'm thinking maybe it's better to not take it in and just keep it as it is because I'm really short-waisted. Like, I don't even, I barely have an inch between my hip bone and my rib cage. I can't, I can't tight lace. Like, I, if I wanted to, I could not do it. It's just bones. It's just bones, bones, bones. So, um, since my bones expanded due to childbearing, I have to make a new one and hopefully get the proportion right so that I have the hip and the bust to offset the waist because I can't reduce the waist. I'm gonna get. Oh my god. Shoot. Really shouldn't be gapping this much in the back. What happened? My mock-up fabric must have been too stretchy. Or something. This is so weird. Because I'm still having a little bit of a triangle issue. Where it's wider at the bottom than it is at the top. And yet, I've got extra here. Like, why? So I think I'm gonna need to add a little bit more on the bottom here to fix this gapping issue where it's not even. I'm not happy with how this is going. Yeah, I think my grommet panels, instead of being straight strips, will need to be more of a, an inverted triangle. So as to address this slight triangular problem.
Cross your fingers. Good fit. And then in the back, I've got a nice situation going on. I think we can take it out a little bit here or take it in here. Wait, in. Yeah, just take a little pinch of it in there. But ultimately, I think it's, it's gonna work. Um, and then I will use these pieces to make that pattern piece. Easy peasy. No problem, right? <laughs> Let's see if I can get it to do this. Yes! Oh, I love it. like it's done. Hmm. Yeah, that's a detail. Anyway, it's a feature. I'm gonna have to fix that. Fun. Ha, ha, ha. 